Hi, it has been a second since I have recorded anything. Focus, focus on me. Are we focused? All right. Um, it's been a minute since we've recorded anything. Um, so I'm here to do like, it'll probably be more like a mini vlog compared to like the other vlogs that I did, but we'll see. I'm just here to provide a little bit of an update. That's Mango in the background. I'm here to provide a little bit of an update. Um, today is the, don't tell me, today is Wednesday, October 13th. Um, recently, my birthday passed. I was on the 10th, October 10th. I am now 24 years old. Um, so I did that. I went out to eat. Nothing much. Um, if you may or may not have noticed, come on, focus. Focus on me. Come on. I don't know what's with my camera today. Am I a little bit too close? Maybe I'm a little bit too close. Um, you may or may not have noticed that Big Dipper is not available on our website. Um, that's because it is sold out at the moment currently. But focus. We're doing a restock to provide a little bit of background. Big Dipper is our candle that smells like forest pine and dirt. And when I was originally doing my inventory for how many jars that I had, I came up short to at the end and I was like, oh, we only have like four Big Dippers. Um, and when we launched, uh, turns out more people liked Big Dipper than like me and Kim thought because when we were doing A-B testing, like everybody really liked Little Dipper. But now everyone likes Big Dipper. So I was kind of like, oh. <laughs> so they sold out pretty quickly. But now we are doing a restocking. I will be making, and I, to provide some context, of course, I was like, I'm short on jars. I, I don't know what's going on. I'm missing some jars. Went through my closet last night and what did I find but an extra box of jars. So I was missing like 16, I think. And I found like 12 of them. So my numbers are still a little bit off, but I found more jars. So we are going to be doing a restocking of sorts. So look forward to that probably in the next week or so, because it takes a week for them to like cure. But within the next week or so, there will be a restock and I will post our social media about when um, Big Dipper is fully restocked. Also, I have been thinking about doing a... Um, I don't know if it's too early for this. So you guys can let me know what you think. But perhaps like a sale, a discount of sorts for like, it's mostly supposed to be for like people that follow us on our social media just to say a little thank you. But I haven't really figured out how I'm gonna fully do it yet. So like, let me know if you guys would be interested in that. It might be like a free shipping situation or it might be like a discount. I don't know what, what do you guys, what do you guys think? Like, would you would you want free shipping or would you want like a discount? Um, Cause I can do like percentage discounts, but then I could also just do like a set amount off of your order. Listen, math is hard for me, okay? <laughs> so let me know what you guys would be interested in. If that's something you'd be interested in, it'd be something we post to like Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, like it's mostly for our followers. I'm sure there might be some people that like don't follow us that are just interested in the sale but I just want to say like a cute little thank you for people that follow a little yeah, for people that follow us early on so yeah that might be uh coming up soon I also don't know if I want to do it should I do it for all candles should I do it for just the fall collection should I do it for just our original candle I don't know yet I don't know yet we'll figure it out but um, I'm going to try to record some of me like making candles. I'm going to have to turn on the other light. So we're going to make some big dippers. I'm trying to think if there's anything important I need to discuss about that. We have a separate video talking about it. But just in case you don't know, usually our process, because I may or may not show the full process, is we wipe down the jars with some isopropyl alcohol to make sure that they're clean. And then I put on gloves. Um, and I, uh, wipe, we wipe down the jars and then after that I put in the wicks, melt the wax. Then we have to like let the wax cool down to like proper temperature, mix in the fragrance oil, and then we pour, uh, into the jars. And then we have to let them cure for about a week. 
Um, sometimes it's like, it might be like a day or like six days rather than like a full week. But like, we let him cure for like a week. Um, so probably not, let me think, today's Thursday? So they probably won't be up until next Friday. So yeah, look forward to that. We'll, we'll have like a, a, a restock something going on. I have been thinking about investing in a cricket. And let me let me do a disclaimer. In our in one of our previous vlogs, we uh and it was on our Instagram and I might have put it in our YouTube as well. So you might have seen it floating around. Focus, come on, come on, come on, come on. You might have seen it floating around on our social media where we have a um a, a jar, a black jar, and then there's the holographic moons on it. We made that with the cricket. We also made our t-shirts with the cricket. And if you don't know what a cricket is, it's basically like a, I don't want to say a sticker maker because people, you can use it for more than just stickers, but you can make stickers, you can make uh, like vinyl and stick it to stuff. You can make obviously t-shirts so you can like cut out, the, the, the idea is that you cut out something and then adhe adhere, adhere it to something. Um, so you can make shirts, you can make you could like decorate stuff. Does that make sense? It probably makes sense if I show it to you, but that's what we were messing around with when we were making the t-shirts and the jar art is what we call it, the jar art. And I thought about just buying one. They were on sale back when we were messing around with them. I don't believe they're on sale right now, so I might wait. I've been told to wait until like the holidays. Focus. Normally it doesn't take this much to, fo to focus. Oops, sorry, I moved you. <laughs> But yeah, I'm thinking about getting one. My concern is, my other, my main concern besides price is like space. We're running out of space here. And the Cricut, it's not huge, but it's not particularly small. You get what I'm saying? So I'm kind of just like, if I get one, I don't know where to put it. And I think there's a mini one so maybe I'll just end up getting the cute mini one. I think it's called the Joy or something like that. So it's like, maybe if I'm still concerned about pricing, we'll get a mini one. We'll see. So, so th you know, keep that in mind. We might have some jar art coming up. We might be doing cute stuff with the Cricut. Okay, let's make a, a restock, make some more Big Dippers. <laughs> 